Ten days after a tornado outbreak devastated Minden, Iowa, another tornado nearly hit the town last night. Officials say it damaged seven properties and a hog confinement. It also took down some trees and power lines. Our Johan Moran got a look at the damage and spoke to residents about how they're holding up. It's been more than a week since a tornado outbreak wiped out buildings, homes and businesses in Minden, Iowa. We lost all our water plant. 90% um, of our business district is gone. We lost, I, I don't know, last count, 40, 35 to 40 percent of our homes are either damaged or not livable. As residents work to rebuild what's lost, they've dealt with more severe weather, including another tornado east of Minden Monday night. This one damaging farm properties, trees, and power lines. We lost power, so they had to get our power back up again. This morning, hy V um, disaster relief showed up with some more generators. And now instead of searching for them, those generators are going to sit there until we're done with them. Zimmerman says the good news this time around is no homes are seriously damaged. No one is injured and it isn't slowing down the community's recovery efforts. They know it's stressful. They know it's this and that, but they all most of them say they're coming back. They're going to build a house. They're going to remodel their house or um, the business is the same. It's just going to be a hard year. The town's water wells are slowly running again and local organizations are still providing food among other resources. Having to worry about where your food's coming from or where you're going to sleep or where you're going to um, just find the support that you need is it's the last thing they should have to worry about. Kilpack says NAMI Southwest Iowa will be in the area providing and coordinating resources until Sunday. As for the timeline for recovery, Zimmerman estimates it's going to take the town about three years to rebuild their water plant, their power generators, and several other buildings. If you'd like to help out, you can donate to the Southwest Iowa Emergency Relief Fund to help Minden get back on its feet. You can find more information at WOWT.com. On your side, I'm Johan Marin, 6 News. Tonight, the National Weather Service confirms last night's tornado near Minden was an EF1. With max winds up to 107 miles per hour, it was one of four confirmed in our area last night.